Okay, let's go to the file menu and open and we'll select Excel test exp4 double click on that and then go to the file menu and let's save as and give it the name Excel X WKG5 and save now let's select A5 to D6 and click the map button like it looks like a globe and then let's click in A8 hold the button down and drag out to around I20 to draw a rectangle and then release it and we'll select uh, the first map option there and say OK and then let's drag the totals column button to the Microsoft map control onto the hardware button and sit, drag a pie chart on and then let's drag hardware down and software and books and then if we go to the view menu and click on Microsoft Map Control to close the control and let's double click on the title of the, of the map and select the text there and let's change that to sales by state let's type sales by state and press enter and then double click on the legend and then type sales in on the to title section there and click OK now let's go to the map menu and select features and let's clear that checkbox by the, uh, the map name and say OK and now we've just got the states that we have data for. I'll click an empty cell outside the, the worksheet and let's right click on any toolbar and select drawing if we haven't got it already selected. We have, so we can clear that. Let's click on the rectangle button and draw a rectangle around our map information. and then let's go to the draw drop arrow and select order and send to back and then click the fill color arrow and we'll select fill effects we're on the gradient tab let's select from center and select the right hand pane variance and OK and that looks nice let's save that and then go file close